subscribers. If you're new here, welcome to my returning subscribers. Hey, Uplifters. Make sure you subscribe, hit the post notification bell to be notified every time I upload, like, comment, do all that good stuff. So today is Motivational Monday. As you all know, this is a segment that I started a while back. So let's get right into it. And I use my kind notes to give me inspiration for these Motivational Monday videos. So here is the kind note. Hopefully you guys can see it. Let's get started. Okay. okay, it says, it does not matter how many times you get knocked down, but how many times you get up. And I feel like all of us can like resonate with this quote because we've all been knocked down. We've all had trials and tribulations where we feel like it was the end for our situation. Like whatever the situation is, like losing a job or not getting the job or just anything. We feel like it's the end of the world. Like we feel just like so down and out and we're at our lowest point in our life. And we feel like we don't know how we're going to get up right but through it all we got to keep on pushing like, no, ma no matter what I feel like we're gonna fall but we have to get back up it's not when we get up but as long as we get up that matters keep that in mind <clears throat> life can and will knock you down but we can't stay down that's the biggest thing like sometimes like like we go through things like for instance, like not being able to get a job, like it's a no, it's a closed door and you feel like there's no other job you want but that job. But if you do the footwork and you take from that experience of not getting that job, we also have to get up fighting, knowing that we can't stay stuck in our situation. We can't stay stuck being down. We have to get up fighting. We have to learn from our setbacks. That's what it is. It's not. I wouldn't consider our knockdowns as failures. It's not failures. It's just setbacks. It, it's set, we all have to deal with setbacks, and I feel like every setback happens to teach us something, to better us, to to strengthen us, so that we can be our best selves. Everything we go through in life that's hard and that seems like the end for us is to build us up. The biggest thing is to do is to learn from the setbacks or the lows or the knockdowns in life and apply them to getting that goal accomplished or getting that job that you really want. Every no is not uh, a definite no. It's just not for you at that very moment or maybe that particular job is not for you. That particular car is not for you that house isn't for you. It's, it's so many reasons, but take everything that you go through, all the lows in your life, and and try to make them positive. Like, oh, that didn't happen because of this, or whatever the situation is. You don't want to look at things in a negative light because then it could cause a ripple effect of mental health even. Like, that, that can cause you just to be depressed and it makes you feel like you're a failure, but I, you're not a failure. You're just a work in progress. You're, you have to go through things to get through the other side, to get, get to better. So if you don't go through anything, then how can you actually learn and to build your character and to, to find strength in yourself? So sometimes our strength comes from our knockdowns, our lows in life, because how you get back up is the only thing that matters. It doesn't matter if it takes a month, a day, a week, a year or two, as long as you get back up. That's, that's the biggest thing is getting back up. So hopefully this can help you. If you feel like you're at a low in your life right now, hopefully this can help you. Just remind yourself. It does not matter how many times you get knocked down, but how many times you get back up. Thank you for watching. Make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe.